Okay, so for reasons that are going to become obvious, we're going to be taking out this old phone system and replacing the phones in the office with uh, AT&T two-line telephones. Each telephone is going to be hooked up to both phone lines. This office has two phone lines. So from the Bex block you can see there are three blocks. The first block has phone lines coming in from a phone service provider. The second block is all of the uh, voice uh, lines in the building. And the third block is the um, the cross connect to the phone system. So I'm just trying to identify which line is which coming into the building. Because well, the only thing that we're saving is the incoming lines and then the uh, drops to each of the wall jacks. So right now uh, you can see the second block is cross connected to the third block and so the phone system is the third block it's connected to the second block which is the wall jacks and we're getting rid of all those cross connects we're actually going to be removing the bottom block later but not right now so once uh, we've gotten that taken care of then we're just going to thread all the lines one line at a time wires that I'm working with is the phone line we've identified and we're connecting it to every fourth pair on the block because each voice drop has four pairs in it. They use the CAF 5 e line and so we're just connecting it and then skipping three and then connecting it again and I did make some mistakes here because they weren't all wired uniformly but uh, for the most part we got all the jacks the first time without checking since nothing was labeled so once we've got all the once we've got the pairs cross connected we don't want to cut this wire between blocks so what we'll do now that it's all in is we'll take your Bex punch down tool and just punch down each line we're just checking right now so we're doing the same with the second phone line we found so we again every fourth pair so we start at number two and the, the reason we can do this is because it goes uh, they, they've punched it down uh, blue, orange, green, brown so we'll be able to use blue-orange pairs if they wired it like a cat 5 v the green stripe green orange stripe blue blah 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 then they wouldn't be able to do that so So now you want to set your Bex tool to not cut and then just punch down every single jack. Make sure you're not cutting. Uh, there, there's no special blade on these tools. You just have to change it so that it doesn't cut. 
you do that by adjusting the the black knob. Because if you cut it, then the jacks that are further down the line won't be working. Test the phone lines now. So we're testing both phone lines. And now we're going to switch back to the cutting method on the fix tool. And then we're going to punch the last two pairs. And there you go. And this ugly thing, we're going to be taking it out. <laughs> 